The following segment is paid for by PR Media. Well, it is a book called Legendary Leadership. It's about contrasting styles of leadership and the journey to change that leads to extraordinary results. Dr. Bruce Baird is a dentist practicing in Texas. He's an author, coach, motivational speaker, and he joins us now today to talk about the book and what it can do for you future leaders out there or current leaders out there. Doctor, wonderful to connect with you this morning. I love this topic. What inspired you to write the book? I think that what inspired me actually was I was such a horrible leader for the first 15 years of practice. And uh, I always say that God has a sense of humor because he gave me four daughters and I had to learn to speak. <laughs> a whole, I had to learn to speak a whole different language. And uh, and that was the beginning of me being able to create a leadership style that uh, that made sense for my office. But I think it makes sense for a lot of people. Well, first off, I love, I have learned quite a bit through failing. Um, so I'm a big believer in just jumping and giving it a shot and then learning from your mistakes. So uh, yeah, that, that's a beautiful thing. Can we talk Absolutely. about this, the significance of, of mentors? I know it played in a lot for you. How do you identify people that are, are, are good mentors when you're, you're building your leadership well, skills? I think it's one of those things where when you're in a situation, whatever the field of endeavor, whether it be dentistry like myself or real estate investing or whatever it is, find somebody who's already done it and uh, and then get to know them. It, it really comes down. Mentors love to share. Uh, they got there. They worked hard. And, and my experience has been that they love to share. And so I introduced myself. I've called, I've literally called, uh, blind called them and just said, Hey, you, you don't know me. My name is Bruce Baird. I live in Texas and asked them uh, questions and said, I really want to know more about this, that, or the other, whatever it is. And in dentistry, you know, I, I, I had probably some of the greatest mentors in, in dental history and it helped me um, move to where I wanted to go much faster and not reinvent the wheel every time I wanted to do something. Well, and we want to caution young people, too. I know that um, I had very uh, significant mentors in my life, but you also need to be careful not to follow the wrong person. What do you think are some of the qualities other than sharing, being open to share? What are some of the other qualities that uh, you'll usually find in a positive mentor? You know, positive mentors are one that will take time no matter when. Uh, they just take time. I've, I've become a mentor in dentistry because I've been doing it for 42 years. I think it's a measure of how long you've been doing something and the appearance of success that you have. Uh, I love mentoring, you know, younger dentists. I, we just had a program in Dallas this last weekend with over 180 people there. And it's just, it charges me up as a mentor. And so when you're, when you're looking for a mentor, look for somebody who maybe has a similar personality style or a similar, um, you know, want, wanting to reach out to others, a, a teacher, somebody like that. And then um, just reach out to them. And, and that has been great for me. I've got a mentor here that is a real estate uh, guy that I've, I've gotten to know uh, by just reaching out and talking to him. And after doing that, I go over to his house probably once a month and we spend, uh, you know, probably yep. an hour sitting, sitting on his back porch. I love talking. it. You know, in, in its best case scenario, it's just it's a it's a friendship and it's um mentorships are relationships where people love sharing information and excellence and that is something that i'm finding is very relevant coming out of the pandemic with so many people changing jobs or people you know in jobs where they haven't been trained yet um when you have someone like yourself who's been in an industry for four decades it's so important that you step up right now and uh show people you know who are just starting out kind of the ropes, how things work. Um, good mentor relationships also are good for both parties. And this was something I was told earlier in my career. If you want to score a great internship, be as useful as possible. <laughs> Absolutely. I'm mean, after this program, every time we do this program, I go home and I'm more productive and I, I, I think differently. And I think, and that's as a mentor helping teach, it also helps the mentor refocus on why they're here. And I, and, I, and I love that. And I, and I just really enjoy getting letters later, you know, a, five years later, or eight years or 10 years later saying how, how I helped change somebody's career or change their, the, their direction that they were going. And, and that's, that's awesome. extremely, extremely fulfilling. It is. It is. It is truly rewarding. Uh, and it's just amazing that you are so willing to share. Where can people get a copy of the book? 
they can go to Amazon and look up Legendary Leadership, Dr. Bruce B. Baird, and that's where you can get it. It's a it's a nice read. It's a little self-deprecating on how bad I was, but <laughs> also, also how we turned it around. So that's that's the part of the deal that we love. Awesome. I love your sense of humor and your humility. Uh, Dr. Baird, uh, please reach out for a copy of his book, guys. Very inspiring, uplifting. If you'd like a little more information, you can also visit the website on your screen.